Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 2. Last time we reached 2000 BC as Emperor Adrian Mohandas Gandhi of the Indians. You know, we haven't really made a lot of progress. I've, I've, as you know, I've, I've explored the whole place. There's a bunch of swamp land over here. I've, I've made a few cities. I've, I've got all these units, I've got all these horsemen, all these warriors. They can't do anything, they're trapped on this island. There is some tundra at the top of the screen, but that really takes years to get anywhere. I'm, I'm not going to consult the High Council, I'm going to say no thanks, too busy. Music, you know, sent these settlers to found. Yes, I'm trying, I'm trying man. I've, there's, there's no space. What, I'm, what I ended up doing now is just irrigating everything. I'm going to use I irrigate to clear the forest. Ooh, currency, yes, currency. Map making! Here it is! Map making will allow you to build ships, build triremes. Okay! Let's just check our science rate. 14 turns. Okay, we, we can't really have anything better. We're getting money and we're getting it in 14 turns. That's good for me. Okay, Madras has made its phalanx. No surplus. That's bad. That's bad. No, so here we've got some, we've got some empty spaces here. We need to change that. Uh, we've only got the never phalanx side but these take too long what, what we're gonna do make a never phalanx three phalanxes fine make a never phalanx fortify oh yes we've got him make a road I'm not gonna build a settler Fine, should I build a temple? Look, wait, I just got nothing to do. Okay, I've, I'm have i gonna now irrigate this. Whereas he's gonna clear that. Yeah, we've got a temple. Marketplace, yes, we can do marketplaces now. Let's do one. Okay, now I want to irrigate this pit. Here. I'm the fourth most advanced civilization. Uh, map making, yes! Look, see there? Trireme. Okay, what are we going to do next? Um, I want to learn whiting. You can build diplomats with that, the fat load of use that is. Who, we, who are we going to send diplomats to? There's no civilizations. Okay, I've built that. You know, change from the temple. But triremes takes 40 turns as well. Tri by the way, triremes aren't aren't really an attack unit. They're mostly for transport. That's see, we should build triremes to explore the world. Yes. Um, I'm not sure though. Yes, yes. So, should I build triremes there or Bombay? Bombay will build triremes in nine turns. Madras. Oh, oh, I've got production one now. I've got some production. That would take still a while. Okay, I, I want to say I'm going to change it to here. Uh, fine, fine. It will take a while. But I've got production naught. Fine, put a damn trireme. You know what, I'm wondering if I should make a mine on that buffalo over there. Okay, here we go then. Made another phalanx. Oh, now you want to make a tri-beam? Oh, okay. Right, well, whatever. I'll tell you more about tri-beams when you make one. Ah, uh, we've irrigated this place. Didn't do anything. Okay, you know we've got a mine on the hill here, and we've got irrigation on the buffalo. You can't have irrigation and a mine at the same time. It's either one or the other. So I'm gonna. Tr I need some more production. Look, production zero. It's gonna take forever and ever to make anything. Look, 200 turns, 300 turns. We need more production. So I'm gonna try and raise that production by doing a mine. 
Okay. Oh, they want us, they think we should build a city here. But there's swamp land everywhere. Alright, I'll build a city. Bangalore. Look, we're surrounded by swamp land, but at least we've got, still got more production. We need to do something about that. I think I chose a bad location for Madras and Bombay. Yep, yep. someone else has built the Colossus. Uh, Lighthouse is quite a um, significant wonder of the world. We'll find that out later. Oh, we built a marketplace. Well done. Oh, we you want to build a bot lighthouse? Yeah, okay. Why not? Or should you build this? I mean, they've already started building a lighthouse. What? Now you say Oracle? Make up your damn mind. Um. Oh no, we, we don't really have a lot. I think we should make settlers. There we go. You can now do diplomats and libraries. Okay, what shall we do? Code of laws, that, okay. Here's what you can do. Code of laws, you can do a courthouse, help with corruption. Masonry, you can make city city wars, quite a lot of different things, the Great Wall of China. Pottery, um, what can you do with pottery? I've forgotten now. But it's quite useful. Warrior code, you can build archers. The wheel, you can build chariots. I'm going to go for pottery. I can't remember what it was. Yep. Diplomats can establish embassies with other powers. Cape, yeah, and you still not, yeah. Well, I haven't met any other civilizations. It's not really very useful. Okay, I've made a phalanx. I'm gonna build another phalanx. Fortify the phalanx. Yeah, see, they've nearly finished their lighthouse. Yep, they've built the lighthouse now. So there's no point in me starting. Okay, I've... what? What happened to the buffalo? There was a buffalo here. Oh ho ho! Because I did that mine, my production has gone up. Very good, very good indeed. Hmm. I wonder what else I should do. We could do with more surplus, really. I'm going to go over here and do a mine. Oh, come on, you can't do a mine on a forest? Well, I'm going to have to clear the forest then. With our next phalanx, got a bit more surplus. I'm going to do a settler because I want to get rid of that damn swampland, okay? Good, I got more settlers. I'm waiting for that trireme. I'm going to do a library, I've got nothing else to do. When's our trireme coming? Oh crap, it's not going to come. It's got production zero, it's never going to arrive. Shit. You know what, I've got three phalanxes, let's do a four phalanx. Come on, I've got nothing to do. Oh right, you're building a trireme, okay, okay. You know what, Bangalore's fine despite all of the swamp plan. It's still got good surplus, good production. Madras has nothing, look at it. We need to go up there right now and do something about it. Okay, what are you going to do, man? Okay, let's clear some forests. Can I mine it? No, clear the forest. Oh, ho, look at this. We've made a trireme. If your ship is a trireme, remember that it may be lost if it does not end each turn near a land space. Yep, this is the thing about triremes. But because they're your very first ship unit, they're quite a... They're, they're not a very advanced kind of ship, they're quite basic. So basically, they've got free movement, where every time, if they land their turn in the middle of the ocean, like not on the coast or anything, then there's a 50% chance of them dying, or of them being lost at sea. Now if you research navigation or seafaring, then you can reduce that uh, percentage to 25%, something like that. And if you build a lighthouse, like a never civilization has done, then you can reduce that probability completely. 
like you, you're t because you've got a lighthouse, the triremes will never get lost at sea. So here we just have to be careful to make sure our triremes are not lost at sea. Now, oh, I also want to actually have some of our horsemen come back. A tri beam, uh, yeah, you can, uh, two units can enter a tri beam, so I want them to, to explore. I want you to, let's see, see when they're surplus of production. I'm going to irrigate this. Okay, where's the tri beam? Who's got it? Delhi has a tri beam. Okay, I want to take our horsemen over there. Yep, here's our tri beam. Here it is. I'm going to change it. Are you kidding me? 150 turns? I'll do a barracks. Here it is. Okay, wait. Does some irrigation. It didn't do anything. I'm just going to irrigate the whole place. No, I'm not going to consult them. They're just going to accuse me of not exploring properly. Irrigate. Now, my horsemen will get onto the boat. Ta da. And now we. Yep. Okay, now we're going to start exploring the seas. Now just make sure you don't end your turn on a, or in the middle of the ocean. Oh, we can do granary and hanging gardens. Now the granary, um, it what it does is, you know your food storage. Um, it, it kind of helps prevent starvation in your cities. It puts like a halfway point so that you can store food at seafaring. I'm gonna I'm gonna learn the wheel. Okay, here we are. We found someone. Let's make a landfall. Uh, yep. Let's check. Oh, advanced tribe. That means you've you've discovered a new city there. This is Calcutta. It's just. Uh, fingers. I would like to take a settler over there. Yeah, this is the kind of time when we need more sets. I mean, look, he's, we're not getting anything, okay? Hmm. Good, good. More settlers. Uh, I've got nothing to do. Let's do a li library. Barracks. Let's do barracks. Clear the forest. You know what? You can go in here and do some stuff about Calcutta. Yep, there we go. And you lot can explore. Okay, here's the guy from Bangalore. Hang on. Okay, you know what? You know what I've discovered? I've discovered that the music is beginning to glitch a bit and it's not good for the recording. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to turn off the music. And we're going to have some new music. Uh, come on, sure I've got some music. What's some good music for Civilization 2? Some good music for... Um, no, no, that's not good music. Um, but we've got, there has to be some good music. Um, they take it down. Um, okay, okay, not not that one. Right. Hmm. There's a thing though. Is that if I put on some music from a nev from one of my songs, then I have a feeling that. It's going to be like much louder than my voice, as on the recording. Maybe I should just do it without music. Hmm. Well, I'll tr let's try putting the music back on. Is it still glitching? Seems fine now. Okay, anyway. Here we are in Bangalore. What do you want to do? 
We can't... Well, we have to go to clear some swamps, please. Because we're getting nothing out of this. Go over here, and the clear the swamp. And... Here we are, I've got a settler. And... Yeah. I'm going to keep to the coastline. Oh, a never advanced tribe? Holy crap. Lahore. Okay, that sounds wrong. Yeah, mine. I'm gonna make a mine. Oh, w watch out when you uh, notice here. This, um, you, if you look very closely, you can see a flag in these cities. Like a very tiny purple flag here, and a flag here. That means that that the city's defended. Here, there's no flag. It's not defended. It's just been built. There's no one defending the city. So if an enemy unit decides to walk right into your city, they'll capture it. And every time one of your cities is captured, the population, that's one population here, five population. If it's at one, it'll go down by one. Because um, every time your city is captured, someone gets killed. So the population will go down by one. If it's already at one, it'll, be, it'll go down to zero, which means it's destroyed and it's gone. Gone forever. Oh, and when you're on the highest Barbarian level, like I am, then the Barbarians will march white on your undefended cities and they'll demand that they'll, they'll hold the city to ransom. They'll demand almost all of your gold, like they'll probably demand like 125 gold from me. They'll demand almost all of your gold or they'll sack the city. And, and they're serious about it, they will sack your city, so don't try and bluff. And there's a quite a lot more to explore here. But here I don't really see any enemy units. Yep, so we it, shall we? Hanging gardens, good for you. Just exploring for the moment, since everyone wants me to explore. Let's check the tax rate. Uh, not bad, I'm, I'm getting two gold every turn now. Can I afford this? Oh, come on, I don't need it. Oop. Here we are. Let's make another phalanx. Let's see. Is the music going to glitch? Yeah, it's glitching. Pick another one. No, no, it's glitching. Stop. Nope, stop. It's glitching. Stop, stop. Okay, I'm going to take off the music. And I'm going to put it back on again. See if it stops glitching. Oh, ah, it works. So that's how I stop it glitching. Yeah, we've got a lot of territory here. That's why I picked long game, you know. Right, what do we do? Okay, irrigating that did nothing. They still got no surplus, no production, no nothing. Okay. I'm gonna go over here and clear out the forest. I'm not very advanced apparently. Can okay, I do chariots now? Uh, I have to do. I'm gonna do masonry. Got, we need some city walls in place, some good defenses. Ah, another hut. Let's see. Oh, I discovered. Polyphesum, which was on my list. Good, good. I'm going to clear out the forest. The library. Science has gone up here. No, I'm not building settlers because... And hang gardens would take 50 turns, I could, I guess. Mm, I'll, I'll start hanging gardens. Hanging gardens where, is a wonder of the world. Hang gardens, I call all and lighthouse. They are all wonders of the world. They have special effects. You can look at help. One extra ha 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 happy citizen in every city, it it doesn't really matter at this point. You're not going to get anyone sad. Okay, what I want my settler to do is build a road from Calcutta to Lahore. So let's do that. What's in this hut? Oh! That's the next, That's that means you get a free settler. See? Okay. And what I want to do here? Oh, we've reached the top of the map again. Oh. Now this is a quite special thing. Uh, there, there's a technology called philosophy. The first, um, the first civilization to research philosophy 
gets um, gets a free civilization advance. In other words, the next technology you decide to research after philosophy, you, you research it instantaneously. Oh, they've abandoned Hangi Gardens. Good for me. Yeah, basically, if, if you're the first civilization to research philosophy, then your next your next technology is you get it instantaneously. Okay, I'm just gonna try picking my music. Okay, I'm gonna go over there, explore, build a road. Phalanx is it? Oh, we can build elephants now, thanks to Polyvision. Should I do an elephant? Look at that, four attack, two movement. I'm going to build an elephant, why not? Let's build an elephant. Build a box. You want more triremes? I've already got one. Not building a damn oracle. Uh, I'll, I'll do another trireme, I could do with more than one. But you see, there's a lot of stuff here that I can find. Okay, I'm gonna build a road. I've got waste one. I don't know what to do about that. Let's make another settler. Yeah. There's a hut. Ooh, gold. I get extra gold for that. Very good. I'm doing a lot better than my first playthrough now. Okay, now irrigate. Ah, you finally, <laughs> you finally cleared out the swamp. Oh boy. He's still doing a white reproduction. I'm just going to clear out all the swamp now. Meanwhile, explore, clear out swamp. Oh, another hut. So many huts. Oh, some more warriors. I get an archer. But he can only move one space, so I'm considering just having him go to sleep. I'm going to go and have him go over there and, yeah, bit of road, let's get this horseman go all the way back. Uh, I'll do a marketplace. Oh, by the way, the world map randomly generated each time. Yeah, you can go. I might go to the coast. Okay, you've built your irrigation. It did nothing again. Did nothing. I don't really want to clear that forest over there because it's actually giving us some good. It's giving us our only shields and food. Okay, I'm gonna go to the other forest. Okay, where should I put my next city? There's all this space here. Where should we do it? The road. Clear out the forests. Oh crap, I, I meant to have him go to sleep actually. Okay, anyway, I'm going to leave it there for today. So I'll work on having my units explore the map, explore this very wide continent. This is quite a big thing. We can put a lot of cities. There doesn't seem to be anyone else living here. So, yeah, I'm doing a lot better. I've got ships, I'm exploring, I've got settlers. I would have to do a bit more of my irrigation and roads perhaps. But that I shall leave for today and I will see you next time. On Let's Play Civilization 2. This is Shan Fanatic signing off and have a very good day.